morning, everyone. Morning. Today we're off to Hollywood. Hollywood Studios. Hollywood Studios. The weather's a bit naff today. It's like drizzly, cloudy, cold, warm. But everything you could get. Stuff, isn't it? Yeah. So I'm in t-shirt and shorts. Max is in a jumper. Yeah. Am I going to freeze to death? I think you'll want a jumper. Mm. I don't want one. I managed to get a us two lightning lanes for Rise of the Resistance. That's at eleven thirty-five. Um, and we're also going to get a Ronto breakfast wrap, aren't we? Yeah. So yeah. let's go. Let's go. This way to the buses. Welcome to Hollywood Studios. Oh, it's a very wet, grey, miserable day. Damp day. A damp day. Where should we go this way? Yes, there's no one there, look. See, everyone else is queuing down there. These oh, people are free. Look. Oh, everyone's seen. Go, 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 go. Hi. Thank you. Welcome to Studios. Welcome. Are we heading off for breakfast first? Yes. Too bad. Too. She's got the name right there. This is the 50s Primetime Cafe. If you've been to a Karen's Diner or heard of a Karen's Diner in the UK, it's a bit like that, but a bit more... Disney friendly. Disney friendly. You've yeah. just read, they act like your family members where they'll tell you off for not finishing your green beans and you're not having dessert. Yeah, that kind of stuff. But you won't catch me in there because I don't cope well with things like that. <laughs> you struggle with it, targeting improv, don't you? I do, I hate it. <laughs> Everyone's heading into Galaxy's Edge. Alex's dog watch. <laughs> what this channel should be called. Like, there's so many dogs in Disney. Oh, Goofy! Oh, yeah, there's Goofy. Entering Galaxy's Edge. Notice the music change. The scenery change. The scenery change. We are off world. Well, did you feel the change in gravity then? This is a cue for Rise what of the Resistance. Thinking here instead of good morning, rising moons. Rising moons and right. setting suns. Setting I don't suns. Know. I want to say that's right. Rising sun. Setting moon. Okay. It sounds good. You do. Know. They are the Coca Cola stands, and these are the cokes you can get and sprites and water bottles. Oh, what are they queuing for? Oh, the Mandalorian. Has he got Grogu? Has he got Grogu? Show me the new mobile order. Yeah. We're just ordering our breakfast. So we've got two Ronto morning wraps and two Tatooine Sunset. Yeah, one of them. Place order, how much does that come to? 41. 41! Now we wait. I think you pick up from here, don't you? Just to the left of the quick service, if you can't find a seat, you come in 
through those archways there there's loads more dining inside and there's also this outside dining area as well but here are our breakfast wraps Ronto wrap. Ronto wrap. so it's pizza egg cheese and sausage and then here are our drinks which is what uh, unsweetened tea with blueberry and watermelon or something I think mm. That's lovely, that is. Who is it? This is a check in for Ogre's Canteen. Blue or green milk? It's right here. It's right here. We had it, didn't we, last time we came? Yeah. And I can't remember which one I preferred. Um, no, nor me. They're, they're like. Are they fruity? Would you say? Um, I'm trying to think what it's like drinking. We're just heading out of Galaxy's Edge because our landing lane isn't until 11:35 and it's 10:30 now. So we're yeah. just heading into Toy Story Land to check out the wait time for Slinky, Slinky Dog Dash. Think? Slinky Dog Dash? Yeah. Um, I mean, it says on the app, it's what, 70 minute wait? 75, I think 75. so. 75. We're going to test the water, see if it is. Changing music, changing scenery, Toy Story Land! Hooray! And your footprint appears on the floor. <laughs> Do you feel like a toy now? Yeah. Now it says 90 minutes. If only we were in the lightning lane. Bienvenidos, our flaking dog. Our lightning lane is ready. Yep. At Rise of the Resistance. Oh, oh sorry. There you go. Thank you so much. <laughs> Look at these little droids. Yeah. 
I saw somewhere they've advertised the, the little walking droids that walk around. Did you see them? Thank you. Oh, it's getting colder. Oh, it's freezing here. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I will warn you, there's probably going to be ride spoilers on this, so if you don't want to see what happens on the ride, on Ride to the Resistance, skip ahead. Thank you. Shoulder to shoulder, you're on the left side. Look at the cube. 
processors. Was this the person you were behind before? No. no. Continue. <laughs> Excuse me. Sorry. Five down. There's two more running. You got told up. I got told up. You'll also be removing any bags and cargo you are currently wearing and hold them in your hands. This includes anything on your shoulders, back, and waist. If you have to question whether or not something's a bag, it is. Take it off now. Leave us. Yes, General. Enemies of the First Order, we will soon snuff out your meager resistance. You chose the wrong side, and now you will pay. The resistance business. You have what I want. You know the location of the secret base, and I will take it from you. We are needed on the bridge. Keep the prisoners here. I will return to finish this personally. Stay on red, they stay on red. Recotos para su seguridad. Permanezcan sentados con sus cinturones de seguridad bien ajustados. Okay. Take this corridor to the terminal west, then head down to the escape pod base. Those droids are programmed to return you to Batu. Hurry and don't get caught. Lieutenant Beck will guide you. Recruits, Let's go. for your safety, stay uh, seated and seatbelt securely fastened. Keep hands, arms, feet and legs inside the transport and supervise your children. Tell them it's a prisoner transfer. <laughs> Did it work? Good, now get a move on. There's a clear path to the turbo lifts at the end of the hallway. Turn right. <laughs> Droid. You're lucky it didn't spot you. Take those turbo lifts and stay out of trouble. Uh oh. Uh oh. You're not on the right. Oh no. Oh. <laughs> Find an alternate route. Who picked these two droids anyway? Oh my god.
it. Ground crews will meet you outside the well, ramp. Well, Brilliant. Great ride. The, the such good ride. It's such a good ride. The technology in that ride is amazing. So amazing. There's so many elements to it and moving parts and just, it's amazing. You know how they say like, phones listen to you and they know everything. Yeah. I've just turned my phone. Look what's on my screen. <laughs> Star Wars. Star Wars, something is coming. There you go. It knows. I see goofies. Hey, go. Hey. Yes. <laughs> <laughs> Out of the darkness, you know the spotlight. We've just come back down to Earth, haven't we? From Galaxy's Edge. We have. Because, unfortunately, they don't serve Starbucks in Batu. Not in Batu, no. So, we're just heading back down to the main strip to get some coffee. Coffee. And here is Starbucks. It's called the Trolley Car. Cafe. Cafe. The Trolley Car Cafe. Ah, and this the is Hollywood the Hollywood Studios Studio Starbucks mug. Nice. Yeah, what's Max got? What's that? Yeah, what's in your hand? And then a Mickey Brownie. Oh my god. Open him up, let me see. Ah. Oh. Cute. One got squished there whilst we were trying to get him out. Oh no. Yeah. So did she threw him in the bin and I felt really sad. Yeah. And then a co-worker was like, no, not Mickey! Nice. Coffee stop done. Coffee stop done. On to Mickey and Minnie is running really well, babe. Mickey Minnie's what? <laughs> Mickey and Minnie's Runaway Ray. Mickey oh. and Minnie's yeah. Runaway Railway. Yeah, easy for you to say, isn't it, that one? Let's go. Hi! Heading into the cartoon world. I can't work out how this happens. Where does this hole come from in the screen? How does this happen? Who ready for a relaxing ride around the park? Now, let's go! 
dead, 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 dead. <laughs> Do something, Mickey! Nothing was gonna go wrong. <laughs> Back into human world. Human world. Did you enjoy that? Do you feel back as a human again? I do, yeah. I feel uh, more 3D than 2D. Ah, uh, quite enjoy being a cartoon. It's good, isn't it? Is he weighted? <gasps> he is! Yeah, he's a weighted plush. He's a weighted Grogu. Oh, cute. Love him. Choose your path. What does that say? Oh, choose, choose your path, path on the back. <laughs> They've got them in Rice Krispies. <laughs> Star Wars he is. They assume they light up. Oh, look at them! Oh, that's cool. I've just seen. They do um, pet stuff. <laughs> Sit and stay, you will. <laughs> Brilliant. It's a galactic star cruise in there. That obviously they uh, know they're going to sell in the hotel. Oh! <laughs> oh, yes. Plus <gasps> tax? They're in Soka's lightsabers, aren't they? Look, they do spirit jersey tote bags. <laughs> and they're actually made by spirit jersey. They're on sale, $40. Oh my god, I like that. Oh, I like this. So, it's like a zip up spirit jersey, yeah. isn't it? So, that in front, nice. But then on the back. Oh, that's nice. It is nice, isn't yeah. it? Yeah. And it looks like tailored as well. Yeah. And then it's got Walt Disney World. Walt Disney oh, World. Nice. I mean, you've already purchased a jumper. Uh huh. I think it's my turn now. Yeah, and I think I'd wear that as well. <laughs> 69.99. I need a medium, and they're out of stock of mediums here. But they can check around the other parks to see if there's any in stock anywhere else. And she said there's a medium in stock in the Magic Kingdom in the Emporium. Yes. So we need to make a way there. So I think we are going to. Hang on. Do we need a tote bag? No, we don't need a tote bag. Uh. Why would we need a tote, I like bag? tote bag? I know you would you like that tote Disney bag. On it. But when are we going to use that tote bag? When we go shopping. And everyone will be like, oh my god, where did you get your tote bag from? Right. And I'll say Walt Disney World. Okay, like they didn't get that from the Walt Disney World on the tote bag. Anyway, that's going to be a regret now. Well, we're here for another week and a half, I'm sure if you want it, we'll find it. The plan of attack now is we are going to leave Hollywood Studios, uh, catch the Skyliner over to the Riviera Resort, yes. have some lunch at their quick service because they have a Very really good. good quick service at that resort, and then, well, I guess after that we can probably catch the Skyliner to Epcot and then monorail from Epcot to Magic Kingdom. Oh my gosh, and because I want to look at... Um, uh, Dom Corona is an artist and he's got a stand in Epcot for the Festival of the Arts and I love his artwork so I want to see it all up. Um, yes, so that is a good plan because we can park up yes. to Epcot yeah, and, and then my... get the monorail from Epcot to the Magic Kingdom to get your jumper. What a good plan. <laughs>
I know, at least she has the word. That's true. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome aboard the Disney Skyliner at Disney's Hollywood Studios. The entire Walt Disney World Resort is over 40 square miles. That's about the same size as the city of San Francisco and double the island of Manhattan. Gracias y observe sus pasos. Gracias por volar con nosotros. This is the Skyliner station. This is like the main hub where you can get connecting Skyliners. So that way goes to Art of Animation and Pop Century. That way to the Riviera and then on to Epcot. And then that way to Hollywood Studios. And then this is Disney's Caribbean Beach Resort with a Joffrey's coffee at the end of the ramp. I do love this resort. I do love Caribbean Beach, yeah. This was the first resort that we stayed in after we got together, wasn't it? Yeah, the very first time we came to Disney World together, we stayed here. It's Jamaica, actually. Yeah, yeah one of these was our rooms, wasn't it? It was on the second floor somewhere. Yeah. They're all in individual sections. So, oh, names of them? Um, there's Jamaica. Um, Trinidad. Trinidad. Aruba. And Barbados. Barbados. That's it, isn't it? Maybe. It's a five, four. But it's quite a, it's a spread out resort, isn't it? Yeah, it's quite big. Like, it goes way back there. And there are two quick service places. There's one in the main reception area and then one a bit further down because of how spread out it is. Um, but each like little hub has its own pool and beach area. I think I remember falling off that hammock right there. Yeah. And then over there they've got a massive like family pool haven't they with slides and yeah. water park stuff. Oh there you go, Old Port Royal is the name of the reception area. We are walking over to Riviera which is over there. Martinique is another one, isn't it? Um, yes, Martinique is the name of the other building. If you don't want to get the Skyliner and you fancy a little stroll, you walk along the pathway around Caribbean Beach and it connects the Riviera. They've got these murals. Mural. That they've oh, done. They yeah. yeah. But they're stunning. To think someone's or a group of people have individually done these. This resort's stunning, isn't it? Yeah. Try not to film people. We are ordering. So I've had a lasagna. <laughs> a lasagna? <laughs> a lasagna. I've had a crepe monsieur with a side of tomato soup. Uh, we're sharing a tiramisu. Uh, we're sharing the side of Romano and herb fries. And then I've got a fountain beverage. Mm. Oh, good. can I have a fountain beverage? I forgot they've got the Coke freestyle machines here, haven't they? They have. So, let me go back. And that comes to 49.23. We've just had lunch in Primo Piatto. Piatto. Um, yeah, sorry we didn't show you the food after we ordered it, but we got chatting to um, some people. Ah, it's um, Richard Vlogs Disney. Richard Vlogs Disney. 
randomly sat next to us. So I said hello to him. We well, are now... Food was good. Mm, yeah. I had lasagna. My first lasagna was cold and I had to go and send it back. And then it was, it was just okay. Yeah. It was quite dry. But I had a crack show with tomato soup and it was actually really fine. And? Tiramisu. And? A side of fries. Yeah. <laughs> well, we were supposed to be sharing the fries, but Alex didn't eat any of the fries. I didn't eat any of the fries. Um, we're now on our way to catch the Skyliner again over to Epcot. Oh, oh no, someone's dropped the dummy. Someone's going to be crying. Um, yeah, Epcot and then on to the Magic Kingdom to hopefully pick up that hoodie. Hoodie. into Paris. We are now arriving at Epcot. And watch your step. Thank you for flying with us. Por favor. And this is the store that I wanted to come to. I love it. This one's new. Uh, maybe one or two of these are new. McDonald's and yeah, I like the I love them. <laughs> We may have made a purchase. Very expensive carrier bag. We got a uh, canvas, didn't we, from Dom Corona? Yes. Yeah. We'll show you in a bit because it's currently wrapped up in a um, cardboard box. Before we head over to the Magic Kingdom to pick up or see if they've still got that hoodie. I think we're going to take a trip through Moana's Journey of Water, yeah, which is brand new to Epcot. Um, so it's only kind of great your adventure if you walk through the jungle. Is it? Is it making a sound? Oh. <laughs> wave, wave, wave. Hi. Oh, it's spring. My magic band is going crazy. And then the water eventually goes back to the sky. Oh, 
Whew, you're looking a bit wet there, Alex. So fun. Like I can imagine on a really hot day. Yeah, that is going to be That's so gonna refreshing. Be so nice to walk on a hot day. <laughs> Thankfully, it's quite warm today. Yeah, but it's quite muggy, isn't it? The end thing where everyone's doing that. If you work as a team, like I figured out, <laughs> it goes everywhere. You get drenched, you get don't drenched. you? Brilliant. There's my wine. And just outside of Virginia Waters, oh, there. Who are the meet and greet? Lovely. <laughs> uh, Goodbye Epcot. Bye Epcot. On to the Magic Kingdom. Yeah, this is like, we're doing four parks in one day. This is not what we had planned. But we're not. We're doing three parks in one day. Unless you want to go to Animal Kingdom for some... I mean... <laughs> then we've completed the challenge. <laughs> is it the challenge or do you need to ride a ride on each park? Yeah, no. So you're supposed to um, go to each park, ride a ride that has a wait time do an experience that doesn't have a wait time uh, and eat food that is specifically like for that park, for that park so and we'll pick up a pin. So we're literally just transitioning through each park yeah, really? Yeah, pretty much. Good. So this is the ticket and transportation centre where you can get the monorail, this is where you get dropped off um, or even walk to if you park your car for the Magic Kingdom and then you get a monorail to the Magic Kingdom or a ferry boat. Or the monorail to resort hotels. Or the monorail to resort hotels. She calls it the Polynesian, the Grand Floridian and the Contemporary. Yeah, we were just saying though. Hi. Good evening. Good evening. We were just saying we've never got the ferry boat before, have we? Nope. So, I think instead of carrying on to the Magic Kingdom on the monorail, we're going to get the ferry boat. Yeah. Which is a bit of an experience. And it's currently here. There it is. And we're back. Hooray! Thank you. Welcome back to the Magic Kingdom. <laughs> on our... Is this our third day, the third time we've been to Magic Kingdom? <laughs> uh, I think we've been to the Magic Kingdom every day. <laughs> I mean, it's a lovely park. It's a lovely park. And we are quite close to the Magic Kingdom for our resort. We are. So, uh, one jumper. One jumper. And jumper. it should be in that shop right there. Main Street Emporium. Back to take more of my money. Oh, I like that. Courage. Oh, I like that. That's a polo shirt. Is that it? That's not it. Is that it? No. I do quite like that one though. Has he found it? Is that it? Yeah. Is that it? Is that in the wrong place? There's no medium. There is a woman trying one on her bed. Oh, is there? Where is she? Let me go and grab it from her. No jumper acquired. Someone had it on and then bought it. Well, we don't know if she had a medium. I bet she did. Up here, do you want to ride a ride? We might as well. May as well, hey. Oh, there's a cavalcade coming, I think. Oh, look at that.
chicken and waffles. Chicken and waffles. Oh, look at these. These are well cute. All these umbrellas are hand painted. Oh, that child is screaming. This is where they serve the turkey legs, they've got all the drinks. And also, Max is going to hate me for this. Pickle in a pouch. Hiya! Hi. Didn't think you came out of this end. Absolutely not. That is 100% all yours. <laughs> cool and crisp refrigerated deli pickle. I feel like this is a lot more effort than it's worth. I can't get in here. Oh, I can smell it. Oh. <laughs> oh, I nearly got it. You're not allowed to make eye contact with anyone once you eat that. Oh my god. Oh, that's not good. <laughs> it's really wet. <laughs> that horrific. Oh, it's gone over me. <laughs> no, bad enough sitting next to you whilst you eat it. Now, Alex has finished with his dill pickle. We are riding the Haunted Mansion. 40 minute wait. Oh, come through this mountain. There's no turning back now. Is this haunted room actually stretching? Or is it your imagination? Mm -hmm. There's always my way. I didn't like that. Who, who, that, who screamed? That scared me. Thank you. There's the hat box ghost. Dine there and meet a load of princesses, and that's the entrance for it just there. Wow, Smile one, two, three. We're gonna do one more. Ah, someone just got engaged. How magical. I think you've just dropped your tongue. Good old Max. Plan is now to go back into the store to see if they've miraculously restocked the mediums in that jumper that one. I didn't know that was part of the plan. That is part of the plan. Right, okay. Um, and then we're heading back to the resort. And then maybe, just maybe... Depending on how tired Alex is. Depending on how tired Max is, because I think he needs a little nap. I am not the Sandy one, um, you. I'm not Sandy. We will potentially head to the Polynesian, because I was saying, we haven't had any doll Whip yet this trip. No. Nope. And there's a really good spot to the fireworks from. Yeah, and we might get some doll Whip and watch the fireworks. Yeah, but look how pretty this is, walking down Main Street with the lights on. Oh, 
They still don't have it in stock, surprisingly. Maybe overnight. Goodbye again, Magic Kingdom. See you real soon. Transfer! Watch your step for me, everyone. Thank you. Nice. Smell like apples. Watermelon. Watermelon. Fresh. Appley. Mm -mm. Oh, what a day. Hi. Hi. That is it for today's vlog. We didn't end up going to the Polynesian and getting doll with them watching the fireworks. Because Alex was too tired. Well, we, we, I think we, <laughs> made the fatal error of lying on the bed. And then it was like, oh, it's half seven, do you want to go? And we're like, yeah, let's go. So we've ended up just going to the quick service here, getting some food. Yep. I've managed to get a dining reservation for brunch tomorrow at Disney Springs at the new summer house on the lake. Yeah, which is really a, nice, Yeah, actually. it's only been open a few weeks, so it'll be fun to try that. Um, so that will be tomorrow. And then also tomorrow is our last night at Wilderness Lodge. Then we check out and meet up with our friends Adam and Gary who are staying uh, for six nights with us. If you've enjoyed this bit of a mad day around <laughs> every park going. Bar Animal Kingdom. <laughs> yeah. Um, but yeah, if you have enjoyed it, please give us a, a like and subscribe as it does help. Uh, so thank you very much and good night. Good night.